Hey everyone and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Runaway Teen series. So the votes are in and they, uh, 11 of you want Alex to stay but 13 of you want Alex to go so sadly that's what's gonna happen but we're gonna wait until Rowan, um, it's gonna be, it's gonna be a few days she will eventually be moving out. Um, I just want to wait until Rowan is a child because I've had bad experiences with Sim children dying in my families. And I don't, uh, or like dying in neighborhoods when they didn't have other people around to keep them safe. So I would just prefer not to risk that. So I'm having, I'm having Goose come in here and she's going to start a jam session with all this. Go here. Um, more. Can you start? Let's see. Join jam session. I want them to play together. It's just good for their relationship. Um, so I put in a new... A new shower upstairs. How's Echo doing? Hi, Echo. Echo sleeping. Echo sleeping. What a cutie cute. Alright, Noel is still working on his stuff. And thank you all for your um, your help in learning what I have to do for... Uh, what's it? Yeah, God. For learning what I have to do to get Noel his funding stuff. That'll be, that'll be good times. So he's going to throw a party. Um, I think he works... Well, yeah, in 15 hours, so we're not going to do that right yet. Oh, and I was going to set a timer on my phone. Crap, I forgot to, so hopefully this episode doesn't end up being too long. Why don't you let, why don't you let your sister take, take a shower? Go ahead, take a shower. Oh, she didn't win today's lotto. So what I did was I got all this set up with um, the beginnings of a bedroom. And he's got sort of an inexpensive little computer that they picked up for him. Everybody stop playing in those leaves. Stop it. Okay, she went in there and she got all cleaned up. Yay! What does she need to do? She needs to build logic. What's her logic skill? Pretty high. Um, she wants to improve social networking. So let's just get that queued up really quickly. She's going to stream a video and um, browse the web. She's not going to start a blog just yet. She's trying to stay low profile. And uh, Miss Ruby, come on in here and research architectural design because you've got oh, some work to do. And um, I can't remember if last time we had her try for baby. I'm not sure. Not sure, but we're not, not try for risky woohoo. Like I said, if you don't remember, what's going to happen is if she ends up pregnant, I'm going to roll a die. I'm going to see um, whether or not uh, it's um, she carries it to term. Because like I said, she's had some issues since giving birth to Lucy. Alright, so they're pretty tired. So I'm actually going to send her upstairs to get cleaned up and ready for bed. Use, take a shower, and then go on and go to sleep. <laughs> and Aldis, you also need to go to the bathroom, take a shower, yep, stop, and then go ahead and sleep in your new bed. Fortunately, this bed is from Around the Sims 3, and um, it's really cute. It's a little alpine bed, but... It's really inexpensive, um, and it has great sleep motives, so very excited about that. I like when my sims can sleep effectively. Alright, Alex is going in to eat something. I want to get them that baker's stand. I want all of my LPs to have the baker's stand, because the baker's stand is so cool. Wow, well, I think we need to do something about those leaves, though. How's Rowan? He's good. And how's he doing? Alright, why don't you head up the toilet, take a really quick shower, eat something, and then you can go to sleep. Oh, Noel's starting to feel sick. I 
and she's doing pretty okay. Her hours start in 12, uh, her hours start in 12. Her work day starts in 12 hours. But I think we should be able to get her fed and all of that in a reasonable amount of time. Yay! <laughs> and yes, we'll have to throw a work party. She's sleeping. He's just about ready for bed. I didn't realize you can put wall sconces inside the showers. That's really cool. It gives a nice glow, and it uh, helps me keep in mind for later. I'm very excited about that. When does he age up? Five days. How old is he compared to Goose? She ages up in three. And when Goose ages up, we'll change up her room to be a little more appropriate. And then, you know, depending on how things go with she and all this, maybe eventually they'll move in the same room together. We'll see. We shall see. She's giving him time to settle in before she really presses the issue of mm. why exactly he wanted to move out of his house. And his parents are aware. They just decided that uh, they need to respect his his wishes. So that's definitely it's definitely sort of, I guess, a concern to Lucy. Just because she's like, okay, his parents are okay with this, and, and I don't know what's going on, so she really genuinely wants to figure it out. Alright, he's gonna need some attention. Um, snuggle. Change his diaper. And then feed him on the floor. Because he's starting to get cranky. I love that this changing table resets their, uh their bladder motive. No, dude, you need to go to sleep. And you need to not sleep in your daughter's bed. It's not that I think he's being weird or anything. It's just, nope, don't make bed. It's just one of those things where it's like, come on, dude. Um, she wants to reach level 5 of her career. She's gonna go eat a leftover cake slice and then we're gonna get her cleaned up and ready for bed. Getting him all taken care of. He's like, no, I'm hungry. Let's make sure everything goes okay. And she's gonna feed him. Huzzah! So now she needs to go to the bathroom. And come on in here. Investigator. Hack information database. Sleeping, 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 hanging out, being chill. Do we have the books? One of us has the baby books. That would be... That'd be our lady here. Go ahead and read this. Oh. Oh. Alice is no longer friends with Lucy. I wonder if that has something to do with her, with uh, all this moving in here. I mean, I can't imagine that it's not at least a slightly tense situation. I don't know. I really don't. Okay, we do need to do something about these leaves, though. Noel sleeping. Ruby. No, stop. Tr stop trying to sleep in your daughter's bed. Why don't you stop here, go to the bathroom, and then go on up to your bed, and go to sleep. Go on. And you know, I don't know if she's the level in her career yet where she can look for clients, but yeah, if we have a party, it'd be cool if we could use the party not only to get funding, but for her to pick up some new clients. I think that'd be... That would be nice. Alright, so we're going to zip right ahead. She's still hacking away. He's just reading, getting smart. So yeah, when he's a child, we will move him 
Um, and while well, we move uh, Alex and little Rowan out to uh, out over to Tristan's house, that's where they're gonna. That's where they're gonna reside. I don't know if you should grab a bowl of that. It's been sitting out for a while. Let's see. Let's see. Um, I'm just gonna put it in the fridge. Um, he's going to serve breakfast. He's gonna work on his cooking. Oh, Sydney. My dog is scratching at the carpet. You're gonna have to get up soon, dude. You're pretty hungry. Oh, we're getting a little bit of money. Earn a raise. Oh, all this is in a bad mood. Uh oh. Whoops. Hang on a second. Giant 3 a.m. lag spike. Come on, we can do this. We can do it. You can do it. Moonlight Falls tends to get pretty laggy. Um, yeah, it tends to get pretty laggy after you've been in it for a little while. Some of the towns do that more than others. So I think we've been in here long enough at this point that we're going to start having some issues with lag. But yes, as I was saying, once he is a child, we'll move him on out. Wow, this keeps her in pretty good mood. It seriously does. And we definitely want Ruby to do some, um, do some work today. She's gonna... I don't know if she has any renovations that she needs to um, complete. Alright, he's cooking. How you doing, Echo? Scratch, scratch, scratch. Okay, he's learned all he can from that. Go ahead and get a toy. And you stop that. We're gonna go ahead and pull out another book. Let's get over oh, the destinations you'll briefly visit. Go ahead and read that. And we want him to be a smarty. There we go. <laughs> and I'm glad that the baby books keep them entertained. Boy, he's just in a bad mood. Does she have school? Yeah, five, five hours. I have the hiccups. Alright, you got your toy. Why don't you practice hunting, please? Yay! He's increased his cooking to level one. Ow, Karg! You burn yourself? That sucks. Wow, everybody's in pretty good shape. Alex apparently never needs to sleep. Did I not reset her? I could have sworn I did. But her sleep motive is not going down. I did reset her. I think it's just a glitch with this family then, but everybody else has had to go to sleep. I am not sure. Okay. I guess let's have her um, go ahead and play online chess for a little bit. She had to go to amount of money. All this is having some breakfast. Goose is gonna come downstairs and grab a plate. Oh wow, they're both in bad moods today. This is wonderful. This is wonderful. And yes, her hour's starting. Three, her hour starting through. What is wrong with me? I'm speaking of friggin' riddles. Um, yeah, we'll just let him do that so he can have some fun. All this is your homework done? Yes. 
He's all set. Don't set a booby trap. Don't do it. Burn that. Burn that too. Up, up. Oh. Look at fly there, dude. In your white leather. Now, conceivably, if he were. Like, he misses his parents. And conceivably, he could go in and work at their store, but it's not something he's quite ready to do. And actually, um, Tristan, you recommended that I have, um, have Alex keep the house and have this group move into that other house I downloaded. That's still a possibility. I'm not exactly sure what I want to do. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, no, it's so dirty out here. See, look at that. There you go. All this will be graduating in a few days. Um, why don't you come on in and take a nice shower? And then when does... When does he work? Actually, hang on a second. Instead of... Um, you... Stop that. We're gonna go, we'll risky woohoo. Not with Ru- or excuse me, not with Alex. You're gonna- You're gonna woohoo with your wife. Not your sister-in-law. Your wife. His grade's a B. He's not doing badly. Now she wants to go set a booby trap. You guys are just the worst. I love you, but... What's going on here? How's he doing with that? He's in pretty good shape. Does he know how to use a potty yet? Did we potty train him? Pretty sure we did. Oh! <laughs> Alright, why don't you go ahead and risky woohoo here then. Oh. Nope, we're having some positional stuff. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, there it goes. This is sometimes when you use post player, this happens. It like it eventually sorts itself out. Um, you know, it's just a an unfortunate side effect. I mean she's gonna be okay. She can get cleaned up before she goes to do a renovation, but He's gonna end up being late for work now. Maybe. No, he's okay. Why don't you go here? You go ahead. And with Noel. There you go. Ugh! Oh, yeah, no. Hang on a second. Um teleport me here. Teleport me here. Uh Fall Festival has made its way to town, and then after this we're gonna have her- oh, nope. I lied. So come on in here and take a shower. <coughs> Excuse me, and then she's gonna go perform her job. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, meet new friends. Meet new friends. And Alex, you're gonna go eat and then help the investigation. So writing was writing was the one thing that helped me overcome my stutter. When I felt I was going to stutter, I would write the word on my hand and everything would be just fine. As a tribute to this healing art form, I'd like to have a writing room in my home. So he needs dining chairs, a coffee table, um, TV, computer, and desk. We're gonna have Alex actually go help that investigation. She should be okay. Um, visit the lot, please. And they're good. He is going to, um, 
run errands for his supervisor. So actually Rowan is going to have to, um, she's going to have to call for a babysitter, um, services, call for services. Okay. She's going to call for a babysitter. Then we're going to go do the renovation and then that should probably, that'll probably be the end of the episode after I get that renovation done. Because like I said, I usually have my phone so I can do a timer. Zufa, give me no um, we're gonna call a babysitter, and then she's gonna go help the investigation. She'll be fine. She'll be fine. Six days until winter. Wants to earn a raise. We should be able to do that pretty soon, actually. Alright, where's the dude? Okay, he's learned enough from that book, but let's see. Where is he? Is the dude coming? Um, let's just go ahead and do it. Usually I try to talk to the Sims and see what their personalities are. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. Client is Chauncey Grimm. He wants two dining chairs, a computer, TV, coffee table. Um, so where does he want it? He wants a writing room. Probably here. Let's go up one more floor and see. Nope. There's no more floors. <laughs> So yes, I'm going to guess that this is where he wants it. Um, so... Two dining chairs. Why does he want two dining chairs? Relevant traits. Oh, yeah, see, if you get to know them and you know the traits that are, are relevant to it, then there's... um. Yeah, there's a blah, blah, blah. If you get, yes, if you get to know the relevant traits, then it's very helpful. Okay, so he wants a dining chair. We're going to get rid of the office chair. And we're going to get him a nice desk. First and foremost, grainy desk. Would he like that? No, I don't think he'd like that. The style of their home is very, um, it's very simple, comfortable, so, hmm, they seem to like white wood. I mean, I can make any of these into a white wood, but that one gives nothing to environment, a whimsical desk. Um, yeah, we're going to go with this one. And we are going to go with, actually we're going to go with the, I already have one that's purely white wood. There we go. I'm going to get that. And we're going to get him a nice, nice chair. Let's see. No, not that one. Something which looks comfortable. Hmm. I'm gonna actually change this so that's yeah, there we go. It's like I can't see. This is pretty. Hmm, no, it doesn't seem right though. I just want something, sort of a simple elegance to it, and I'm not seeing anything I want. <laughs> Let's see, getaway dining chair. That's nice. 
I like that. Um, and then we're going to put... I don't see any reason we can't put another one over... Hmm, where can we put it? Because he wants a TV. I'm going to put that there. And a new computer. Let's see. This is a nice one. Oops, sorry, that was my phone. And a TV. Let's see. Where can we move? You know what, we can move this here. Actually, we can, can we angle it? No. So that goes there, but we can angle this. There we go. And then we're going to put a TV over here in the corner. And it should be a decent TV. No, oh, it's a little too modern. Hmm, how much do we have left? Oh, we have a lot of the budget left, so we could get him a nice TV. Um, this one's awfully large. Hmm. This one works. Let's see. Move this over one. That there. Um, this goes back on the desk. I apologize. I usually, like I said, I usually turn off my phone. Um, actually, we're going to move this here. We're going to rotate this and put it in front of the window. And we're going to put this here. Just shifting everything around. This over here. This whole setup right there. There we go. And move that. And actually, we're going to put that there. And I know. Over here. Nice little reading area. Perfect. We can angle this actually, I think. Give it a little more visual interest. Okay. Oh, and a coffee table. Oh, and a coffee table. Let's get. There is one that goes with uh, this. Let's see, where is it? Right here. And everything gets so snug. You know what? Instead of that, then we're going to get him a TV that goes on the wall. Yep. Nope. Um, we don't want to go over budget. So, actually... Hmm. Oh. Kenny's making an appearance, if you can hear him. Hey, everyone. <laughs> Is that the internet? Yes. Okay. Um, let's see. Hmm. I don't know, that just seems like a tight fit still. Let's go back to the TV. Oh, my phone's blowing up. Kenny's coming in here making noise. Sorry, everyone. <laughs> No, he's not. He's really not. You know what? I guess we'll put the coffee table, uh... You can go past, Kenny. I'm waiting for the internet. Oh, yeah. He's resetting our internet, because our internet has been sucking majorly. Oh, God, this is... 
This is an interesting design conundrum I have going on here. I feel like I'm solving a puzzle. Let's move this for a second. It, it. Okay. Put this across on the TV. Hmm. Put this out in the hallway. Okay. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to move the TV over here. This here. That there. We're going to move this over here. Move this here. And the coffee table in the center and this is no longer angled this is going straight up against the wall and they can fit when the chair is that close to the coffee table they he should be able to fit if he gives me that spiel about how like how am i supposed to fit into my stuff i'm gonna punch him in the face you can bet God, I just can't make up my mind on how I want this stuff. Um, lower, lower, move there. And they'll just be bookending the windows. And we'll move this. No, that'll be in the way. So we're going to keep it there. And then we're going to change the color of this over to that. Okay. This is, this is my choice. This is what we're going with. <laughs> And we're going to turn in the renovation. If he says he doesn't like it, I'm punching him. Punching so hard. Punch, punch. Glum. Is he not here? <laughs> mm -hmm. Baby. Is the babysitter Baby, there? No. I'll come over as soon as I can. Hey, you're not him. Let's see if he shows up. You better leave work. Where's the babysitter? Let's take a look here. Let's put the walls down, though. Where is the babysitter? Two of those chairs have whoopee cushions. Okay, apparently there's no babysitter here. Damn. Okay. You need to go home. You need to go home. There we go. Okay, let's see what he has to say. Go on inside, Chauncey. If you don't like this, swear to God. I swear. Yeah, babysitter. I should call and report you and take back that seventy-five dollars because you did nothing. Simply on now. You did <laughs> nothing. Zuhan. Okay, he's happy with the desk. Hmm. Yabluki. He likes his original lamp, the one he already had. Hmm. <laughs> Lorky. Listen. Um, Noah's found. No, we're not gonna take money illegally from the campaign. Even fund. nerd. Mm hmm. Weebs. Fulalibs. Um. Wouldn't mind working with you in the future. Yay! So overall, I think you did a good job. I totally needed a new computer. Um. I'll take it myself later. <laughs> <Right here. laughs> Inventory. Wait, one sec. Let's pause it. And then we're going to... Um, 
camera photos camera settings wait no camera what are the settings take photo Uh, leaves the house you can use your cell phone to take a photo for your portfolio decorating and designing is hard but rewarding work take heart ruby you for your accomplishments have not gone unnoticed in honor of successfully completing five jobs the town of moonlight falls would like to award reward you with the architectural designers honor trophy please stop by city hall to uh, receive excuse me receive your award yay yay so there we go. That's going to be it for this episode. Um, don't berate his ignorance. Just go home. Actually, there might be other jobs, but she needs to eat something first. Do you have anything in your inventory? Yes, eat. Sydney. Everybody's making noise. Um, so yeah, we'll pick up with a... Ever since the age of 11, my child has insisted on getting a brand new bedroom by the age of 13. I see no need to deny this request. After all, my, what my baby wants, my baby gets. Um, so we're going to be doing a teen room. So that's going to happen next time. Um, I want to say thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. And um, yeah, please remember to give this video a rating and drop me a comment. I love hearing from you. And um, just as an update, I am trying to tie off some of my old series so that um, like Speakwell is going to be ending really soon. And I want to start fan service minis again and all that stuff. And I'm going to be transmuting a few challenges and things like that. So I'm trying to just um, clear up some space in terms of my schedule and, and what I'm going to be able to do. And then from there on out, I want to maybe start a new challenge. So I'm thinking about which one to do. Um, yeah, so I'm going to shut up now. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!